So first, let's take the defense at their highest ground. And I think the most effective way to do this is to go back to Mr. Tanner's very own profession. As well as a shoe, cast, and then a bloody fingerprint on the Budweiser. The killer probably did not use the deceased car or the defense car's getaway vehicle. What about the missing evidence? The type AB blood, although connected to Bud Tanner, it's there's no direct correlation. And they told me that they saw a body at around 5:30, but they were super nervous and they didn't even get close to the body. I just got done doing a mock trial. You reenact a real life trial uh, as an attorney, a witness, and it's just a whole lot of fun. You get to see yourself and see if you like being a lawyer. Basically, we have a false court case and we are trying to prove either the side of the defense or the prosecution. I was on the defense, so I was trying to prove that our defendant was not guilty of murder. The case was a murder. A man named Ireland Boyd, his nickname's Hillbilly, was supposedly murdered by Daniel Bud Tanner. I thought it was really interesting. It was definitely challenging, and it was something new for me to do, which really challenged my mind. Like, I came into this not really knowing a whole lot, of, whole lot about law, and now I feel like, I feel like I know whole bunch, like I could teach some, someone about some law stuff. The group that I was in to actually do the case with was definitely very different personalities and we all clashed at first. So it was interesting to see how we really came together to work towards one common goal. It's really easy to find your niche because everybody's in the same position as you. Uh, nobody comes into this like having a friend, really. So if you just come into it and you are open and you come and you introduce yourself to people, you're gonna find uh, a group of people that you're friends with for the next nine days. I'm not gonna lie, I was really scared at first to be away from home for this long, but once I got to know the people here and really got into the program, I'm so grateful for this experience.